Hi friends, welcome back to another video. So today I'll be explaining powers and roots. So first in powers and roots we have square numbers, square numbers and square roots. So what are square numbers and square roots? A number is squared when it is multiplied by itself. For example, a square of 5 is 5 times 5 is equal to 25 and a squared and it's simple is squared so 5 times 5 can also be written as 25. Then square root means that when the number that was multiplied by itself is divided by itself is known as square root. So for example, if we have 36, the number that is divisible by itself, not by itself, the same number, which is example 6 by 6, which is both same numbers, which will be equal to 36. So the square root of 36 will be 6 times 6. So this is how we will calculate square roots. And 5 square is equal to 5 times 5 which is 25. So this is how we calculate square numbers. An example can be 13 square is equal to 13 multiplied by 13 which will be 169 and second example can be 7 square is equal to 7 times 7 which will be 49. Where is in square roots if we have 324 of square root which will be 18 of this. So 18 the multiplied by 18 will be 324 and the square root of 324 will be 18. Another example can be another example can be 144 which will be square root of 144 is 12 and the square of 12 will be 144 so this is how we will calculate square roots and square numbers second type of powers and roots are cube numbers cube numbers and cube roots so what are what is exactly cube numbers and cube roots so a number is cubed when it is multiplied by itself and then multiplied by itself again for example cube number of 3 is 3 multiplied by the same number which is 3 multiplied by the same number which is 3 so 3 times 3 is 9 then 9 multiplied by 3 is 27 then for Cube root, a cube root of a number is a number that was multiplied by itself to get the cube number. For example, the cube root of 8 will be 2 multiplied by 2 multiplied by 2. So 2 roots are 4, 4 roots are 8. So this is how the cube root is calculated. So for example, if we have, which is, One hundred one thousand cube root which will be 10 multiplied by 10 multiplied by 10 and then second example can be 4 cube will be 4 multiplied by 4 multiplied by 4 which will be 4 4 are 16 multiplied by 4 will be 64 so 4 cube is 64 and 1000 cube root is 10 multiplied by 10 multiplied by 10 or oh, the answer will be 10 so it will be 10 over here it will be 2 so this is how we calculate cube numbers and cube roots so the next type of powers and roots are other powers and and roots so if example if we have a number that is not square root 
or square or cube root or cube so how do we calculate that number for example if we have x multiply by x multiply by x multiply by x is equal to 729 so first we will use the calculator and write square root of 729 which will be 9 multiply by 9 multiply by 9 so this will be 729 so the square root of square root of 729 will be 9 or for example if we have more than that we have 400 square root of square square root of 400 so square root of 4 is 2 so we write 2 and if there are two zeros then we put one zero over here which will be 20 square will be 400 then third example will be if we have square root of 27 cube root of 27 so which number can be multiple multiplied three times to get 27 so so the 2 cube will be 8 then 3 cube will be 3 3 is a 9 9 3 is a 27 so cube root of 27 is 3 then another example will be if we have 100 over here right 100 cube so 100 multiplied by 100 multiply by 100 which will be 1 2 3 4 5 6 so it will be 1 million so the cube root 100 cube will be 1 million and this is how we will calculate different types of powers and roots